Hi guys, so I did my unboxing and setup of the Drobo 5D3 and that was absolutely great. I'm really happy with this unit so far. I'm so glad I've actually found a device that will back up all of my artwork quickly. Simply, I don't have to do too much. But I want to talk to you about something I stumbled across in my vast amount of research looking for a good backup system for digital artists and creators like you and me. I stumbled across the rule of three otherwise known as the 3 to one rule. And this means that you have to have three methods of backing up. Two physical backups and one cloud-based backup system. Two physical you can have, you know, in your house, in your studio, or next to your computer, wherever. And the third one, the cloud-based one, is in case something happens to your home or studio. So if here I had a fire, for example, well, my Drobo takes care of both of my physical backups for me. And that's great. But if there was a fire and I lost everything here, well, yeah, insurance would cover me for getting a new Wacom, a new Dell, new laptop, new camera, new everything. But I'd still lose all that valuable information on the Drobo. So having a cloud-based storage system that's why the three to one rule, the rule of three exists. That's the whole point. How many of you guys are actually doing this? How many guys, how many of you guys have heard of this? How many of you people have, you know, what, what's, does this sound logical to you? I mean, to me, it sounds completely logical. As soon as I read it, it was like, that's the idea. That, that just sounds brilliant. I, if I squeeze it all down in my head, I need about 10 terabytes of cloud storage to use. Um, when I find a good one out there for digital arts and creatives, I will make a video and I will let you know. Maybe, you know, maybe use it myself first and, and kind of let you guys know what I think of that and how secure it is, how safe it is, everything like that. Probably, you know, try and do a review of that. Yeah, so the rule of three, there you go. But while the Drobo is absolutely awesome and it backs up all of my work right here in the studio, maybe having an off-site is a brilliant thing to do. And also, you know, you can keep backing up to extra drives as well. You know, the more drives you put in your Drobo, for example, or using external drives as well. Um, there's nothing wrong with that. If, like me, you were using external drives before, the Drobo, then there's nothing wrong with continuing to use those external drives as backups. So the more backups you have, the better. But this whole rule of three of having one offsite thing really makes sense to me. For me, I'm not using cloud-based storage at the moment, but I do send every week, I send a portable drive offsite. So if worse came to worse and my studio went up in flames, yeah, I might lose work, but I'd only lose a week's worth. So that's where I am. Let me know where you guys are, what you're doing with backup, and I'll chat to you guys soon. Well, thanks for watching. Be sure to comment, like, and even subscribe to my channel, Lawrence Can Draw. And if you really did like what you saw here, you can see more of it on my website, lawrenceman.co.uk. I'll see you next time.